Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to a look at Black Geyser Couriers of Darkness. It was actually a CRPG that was Kickstarter backed about 2018 or so for about 108,000 uh, pounds. So, decent budget for an indie game as well. Uh, went on to early access for about six months, just came out full release. The, the positive is, is about 70% positive reviews. Uh, I think main complaints are going to be low time. Some other things we'll have to see if they improve upon that. Yeah, it's brought to you, uh, recommended by my hetero life mate, Naren. A good old friend of me. Uh, let's get uh, into a new game. I am a big fan of uh, CRPGs and RPGs in general. Well, can we create a new character? Okay, so you have a couple little... Got you, it's a little bit scary. So you got a bunch of choices. Okay, very nice. A little bit of old school character portraits. I, I kind of appreciate that a little bit. Uh, let's get something new. Yeah, let's create a new character. Create something maybe wacky. Have to see. Well, look, I like I like the old school approach of what I saw in the videos of this. So keep an eye on the loading screen here and see. We are running on a pretty beefy PC, so I don't really feel like that should ever be an issue, but. Just on the character creation, this is taking a little bit longer than it should. But all right, there we go. Okay, so we do got human. Breaking rock or breaking skulls, same to me. Okay, I can do a little bit of voice acting as well. My blade is sure, my arrow true. Not bad, might be a little bit old school. And we got Feldegug. My blade is sure, my arrow true. Okay, so they're like, uh, a little bit of Dark Elves or Ice Elves, maybe? A cold race of Elves. Okay. Interesting. Cunning serves where violence will not. Ooh, so interesting. I don't really know if the test horns are my kind of thing, though. Do they have female? Okay, let's just get a look of everything here. My blade is sure, my arrow is true. My blade is sure, my arrow, arrow is, is true. true. Breaking rock or breaking skulls, same to me. I am ready for battle. Okay, as humans, we can basically do about anything. My blade is sure, my arrow is true. Uh, we might go with Feldegug and a female. Let's let's go with that. I'm trying to make fighter. What are the choices here? Oh, so we can do a subclass. Oh, I do like that. So we can do a little bit of. You won't be like the top notch in either class, but you can do a little bit of combination. Let's check this out. Fighter. That's generally the light pretty easy. Guides to... me in all things. Cleric, not a horrible idea. I am never lonely. My friends await my summons. So basically a summoner. A little bit of necromancy. I don't I don't mind that idea. Nature is my province. Who dares stand against me? Okay, I think they do have probably some specific classes just inherent to the race as well. Or could you just go straight Your up Necromancer? Dusk is my dawn. Okay, kind of intrigued by that. I shall be your guide the to the wilds of Yerengal. The wise shall fear my spells. Okay, Spellweaver's a little bit different from a wizard. Keep your eyes on the coin. Where has it gone? Oh, nice. We could be a swindler. I kind of like got the bird there. That's that's nice. All right. Which is different the from the thief. Are my home. Come, let in the or a winter mage. I Not with that hat, though. Okay, I'm kind of really digging Your the necromancer. Is my dawn. So we can choose up to two additional classes for our character. Ooh. Yeah, maybe. Okay. Kind of like it. 
Keep your eyes on the A corner. necromancer and Where a swindler. Now let's just let's not go only two. One more might be cool, but a necromancing swindler. I kinda like that. Alright. Alright, so now we have points to distribute. Uh let's go over this really slowly, just okay. Guess more about fighting, maximum health, evading incoming cat, and of course carrying capacity. Evading and dodging parrying. Okay. Very spells. This aim and accuracy. I do like a good amount of charisma though. Base health, resistance value. I don't feel like really supernatural is probably. Yeah. Unless you're warrior outlaw, maybe a little bit more. Okay. Let's go a little bit. I would like a lot of charisma, though. Is there a point where we're capped out? 13. Okay, that's fair. Let's go 13. And I'm going to put a little bit in the physique, too. That's not too bad. I do I do like that picture. That's, that's uh, nice. Okay, so we have one point in general. Bargaining and persuasion, learning and research, or brewing and drying. Oh, this is very old school. I'm liking it. Okay, reading various text scrolls and recipes. Bargaining and persuasion, though. Oh, I do like a good dialogue option, so let's... Alright, we'll go with that. Hide and sneak. Not a horrible idea. Who's stealing and planning item? I feel like this is a very ambitious... I'm very interested to see about this, because... This is very nice. Picking locks is also not bad. I mean... Hide Sneak might be good. Originally, and then let's also... Ooh, shady dealings. All right, I was thinking about arcane studies, but all right. Weapons. I feel like we want to be rods and staves. Pull some blow damage. Thing and fusta balls. Those and arrows. Uh, maybe rods and staves. Let's go rods and staves. We'll pick one up. Initial spell. Okay, let's just be very sure on this one. 3 to 5 poison and acid damage. Heals up to level 9. Ooh, I do like the idea of a death pulse. Could poison our weapon. Predator's Fang, that would be kind of nice. I kind of like the idea of Death Pulse, though. Okay. So we do know Death Pulse. And our resistance. We got some cold resistance because of our race. I'm liking what we're doing. Major color. Oh, it's for our armor. Minor color. I would like some red. Reef blue. Alright, green. Air color. Tilbar, I would go with that. Not a, that is a freaky portrait, I gotta say. Not a ton that might be 
I mean, you do don't look like a ice elf, but uh, I mean, then we'll go with the white hair. Then that will make it kind of that. All right. I like the hat. That's growing on me. Okay. Your suggested name, Mean Hild, Alda. Hmm. Yeah. It's nice to be needed. Let's see what other voices we have. Speak your mind. No, that's that's too much. Don't you have another like spittle? That's that's uh. We'll go with Why Rascal. Not? That's too much. <laughs> and let's just go with the regular classic. There might be some rules we don't know, so. All right. Liking the look of this so far, you already kind of sold me right now. Uh, sure, we can change that later if we need. I made 30 bucks for a CRPG because usually you can get a ton of hours at it. I think it's always kind of a good deal. Weird thing on game capture though, like someone down to loading like that will cut out on the video, but it doesn't happen on the main game. Oh, why didn't I look here first? And more to the point, why must I come fetch you for every little thing? Okay, voice acting is a little bit hit and miss, uh. What am I supposed to be doing right now? Oh, you do know this is the day the Lords of Isselbright are visiting? You are simply the laziest... Never mind. But I do appreciate voice acting, don't get me wrong. The Lords are already here and waiting to be served. And for goodness sake, don't forget to gather your things from your chest before you come to table. Everyone's going to die at this dinner, aren't they? I can, I can call that right now. And graphically a little day a little school, but that's on purpose though. Okay. Alright, side quest. No quest. Journal, compendium. And they do have a greed versus hope kind of thing going on. So we can take a really dark turn throughout the world and I think it will affect it quite a bit. So it can be greedy or generous, vilifies or idolized, or unknown or infamous. So there's not a lot of greed right now. Okay. I'll do it. I'll check the map as well. I mean, it's a pretty small map. Let's talk to the local guard. Yeah, so not only probably the major parts are voice acted, and I'm okay with that. Can we already look at the map though, or are we looking at the overworld map? Okay, there we go. Entrance exits. I'm just trying to get the tutorial thing out of the way. Oh, you just want me to move over there? Okay, got it. No problem. Just curious. Yeah. Okay, go serve the drinks. I got it. Okay. Isn't that weird? There's also just a crystal On ball over way. here. Oh, ooh. Ooh, it's a magic show. Okay, so you're the court mage, Alusa. Hurry right. it up, please. That's not fancy. Ever wish to sneak out of responsibility? Yes, please. I mean, I can do death pulse. Do you want to see that? No? Alright, so it looks like we're a common servant here. That was a heck of a low time, I would say, for just a small area like that, really, though. Well, I think you might have to be a little bit more patient with this one.
It's not terrible, but that was a heck of a small area. In case all the guests are waiting. Oh. I'll do it. I'm supposed to grab my stuff in the chest, though. Okay, library, master suite, my room. Okay, so let's go around this area. All right. Going to sneak out of work. The rug is wrinkled. That looks fine to me. Not doing it twice a day. Potion of cure all recipe. Uh, okay. I'm gonna take that yoink. Uh, I'm already stealing from all my. Okay, that's fine. Identify scroll. Yoink. As you can see, I'm a bad employee. Another recipe for potion of healing. Okay, yoink. And the voice in the woods book. Yoink. Nicholas order, okay. On my way. So we gotta go back through the main hall. I'm just trying to avoid the Lord of the Castle, probably. If I just stole some stuff. So the chest will be where our stuff is. Okay, so I got some general clothes. Old damp robe. Powder of darkness. 22 gold. We got some knives and a dagger. Okay. Okay, so I can view that in the recipe now. All right. I don't know if I had to keep that on me, though, at all times, but... Very detailed, really. I mean, but isn't that, like, the same... That is... That's like a change of clothes. Alright, I'll just keep the dagger, just so you know. Just in case we need to. A weapon down here, actually. And maybe if we need some throwing knives. Not general consumables. Okay. So two weapon sets. Alright, fair enough. Okay, so we can use like blind it onto somebody. Okay, we'll keep that in mind. Wow. Alright. Okay. Okay, so go for to find Billin, who is over there. Of course. Like in the music so far. This is a little rough. Are they gonna serve the food? I think that's apparently my job. Hello. At Where are last. the servers? Oh, don't go twisting an ankle in all your hurry. You take care of the drinks. Lord Wolcraft and Lady Larenthal prefer wine. Lord Joran would like ale. Lady Virilin and Lord Espen want mead. Go! Two wines, an ale, and two meads. Oh, I, I can't remember any names. Can we use tab to highlight all the stuff? We're gonna loot. Weak potion of healing, I'll take that. We can put that on the powders and consumables. I'll go problem. wherever I'm needed. Hello. I know I don't know where the drinks are. Maybe back here, I guess. I need to go back here. Potion relaxation, we'll take that. Pity ring, okay, we actually need that for that spell. Yeah, I'm like the world's worst employee right now. That's that's okay. Yeah. 
Tread lightly. I, I am truly treading lightly. It said to serve drinks, but I have no idea what the drinks are. Yeah, I, I know. Uh, I just I don't know where the drinks are. Oh, they're right there. That you know, seems they... like the place to be. Why don't you just grab the stuff you you mean it's right? Okay, so we got all they it's right there. Go grab it. You lazy bums. Okay, so Lord Espen. I do like this is old school. You would like some ale, my Hello. good man. You're here, finally. Your ale, my lord. I must have a talk with Belene later. Uh oh. Am I gonna get whipped again? Lady Verlin would like some mead. Oh crap! Do you need? Thank you. No, I got him the wrong drink. Hello. Oh, the carriage was quite stuffy, and my throat is sorely parched. All right, you mead. Just what I wanted for a change. Okay, I'm 50-50 on this. That's that's okay. Lord Woolcroft. I got you guys mistaken. Oh, you would like some staff. wine? I was starting to wonder if you'd all fallen ill with the plague or something. Huh. On my way. I think mostly right. What are they gonna do? Get fired? Game over. Lord Joran, you need. But like you're the ale guy finally. Well? You know this is supposed to be served at room temperature. No, no of, course of course you, you don't. Alright. I'll be ashamed if something horrible happened to all of you. And Lordy Larenthal needs wine. Uh, yes, yes, get on with it. I suppose you expect me to toss you a coin for doing your job. Yeah, that would kind of be nice, actually. Shall we do business, gentlemen? Gentle ladies? Yes, let's. We are convened to discuss the situation with Deron Gould. What has been rumored and suspected for so long has finally come to pass. A council of nobles with mining interests in the town have declared themselves independent from the crown of Isilmerald. It's a little bit of rebellion and civil war almost. I don't like this dirty business. Sending a list of grievances to the king. Sounds more like the actions of a bunch of uppity peasant farmers than nobility. There are ways these things are done. And there are ways that kingdoms may crumble. I understand your feelings on the matter, Lady Larenthal. But Darren Gould enjoys the sympathies of many important persons here in the North, and I number myself among them. What's more, there have already been defections among the Azimerald nobility, most recently Aldnar. She speaks of your son, Lord Espen, who chose to forsake his birthright to join the rebels. Oh, no, she didn't. Ah, yes. Thank you, Lady Larenthal, for reminding me. And I'll thank you, Lady Viriling, not to speak his name on this estate, nor in my hearing again. Oh, why, I will... <laughs> but you won't. Oh, ho! Getting saucy in here. Now the voice acting is, is kind of rough too. Uh, I think you might have to be a little more forgiving on that. Baldur's Gate and you know, Divinity Original Sin 2, that's, that's at the bar for CRPGs and voice acting. Whatever the loyalties of uh, the young Lord of House Espen, the Southern Nobles have many legitimate complaints. Heavy, some say ruinous taxation, Delayed shipments thanks to the Crown's regime of inspections and checkpoints. The King's insistence that Daron Gould's military, e even the Town Watch, must be trained in the North. It's quite a list. Sounds yes, like it's all very sad. I'm sure they toss and turn the night away on their beds of gold bars. Taxation and bureaucracy are simply the facts of managing a prosperous nation, of keeping our enemies at arm's length. How long would their precious minds keep producing without the king's protection? I like how I just keep hanging out and they don't notice me. 
Did you know I heard this rebellion was prompted in part by a belief making the rounds in Deron Gould that the king himself is cursed? Oh, king could be cursed. <laughs> I, I don't know what that laugh was, but... Oh my! What exceptional nonsense! <laughs> Have they been breathing the fumes of their own minds? All right, very amusing. But like Lady Varellen, I am not unsympathetic to our southern friends. Surely some of Isilbright's rules and dictums could be culled, especially if it means avoiding war. A much more costly proposition than losing a handful of coin in taxes. Wise counsel, my friend. But I fear the time for compromise is already past. The message from Daron Gould was deliberately provocative, leaving the king no way to negotiate or save face. The time has come, lords and ladies, for us to commit our forces and our purses to our rightful liege and crush Daron Gould. Or throw in with the rebels. They have the gold, they have a well-trained army, and most importantly, they control the mines. In a conflict of any significant length, having control of the source of the kingdom's metals means they must only outlast the North, rather than outright defeat her. You there, what is your opinion on recent developments? Oh, wait, what? I, I, I just, I'm a servant, uh, actually more like a slave. Okay, I guess I will inspire what the kingdom decides. You're asking the scullery maid? What does- I agree. I mean, I'm- What am I even doing in here? I should be in the back getting whipped. Kindly do not interrupt me while sitting at my table. Do we have a thing? Do for... we have a thing going maybe? I well, don't know. Well, speak up. Um, ah. Huh. Wait, this is about money, though. Yeah, if it's only about money, hey, peace. Give peace a chance. Very noble of you. I agree that the value of gold must be held cheap against the value of doing the honorable thing. All right, we did good. I did good. I knew that was gonna happen. Earthquake. My ladies, my lords, we are under attack. Please take shelter at once. Perhaps the cellar. You may wish to arm yourselves, my lords. By whom? They make no secret of their allegiance. They fly the banners of Daron Gould. I bet it's your son. That one was far at the back. All I could see of him was his vibrant red hair like a flame. Ah, a ginger. Altena. That's his son, I bet. Too little, I'm afraid. Their numbers are overwhelming. We were forced to fall back to the main gate, and they're already... Surely they will listen to reason, wherever they're from. They won't kill us out of hand like so many soldiers. They wouldn't dare. Right? Right? right. Um... Calmly, my friends. Let's all go out to meet them. They're not bandits after all. Oh, you guys are all dead. Yes, go ahead. You have my blessing to speak on my behalf if it's of any use. He's, he's bugging out. You? What? Where are you going? I'm going to sell her. Come with me. Make haste. Oh, hey, uh, all right. Um, isn't that your wife over there, though? I mean, all right, whatever. I'm down with it. Of course. Later, guys. You, and you lot, with me. The main gate has already been breached. The House of Espen is about to fall to the agents of Daron Gould. Now, never mind that. Just follow. And you, you've always been a first-rate skulker at Key Halls. Yes, your weird hobbies are no secret to me. Best not face armed soldiers head-on. But... Do what you can. Okay, I mean, I mean, what about the necromancy, but all right. 
I'm coming. I'm coming. We do have a, like a line of sight fog of war too. Why? We're just going around. That doesn't make any... Alright. I'm coming. Oh, there's combat going on. Oh, that crap. seems like the place to be. Okay, um... Ah. Yeah. Okay, never mind. Run away. Run away. I, I screwed up. I screwed up bad. Help. Guys. This crazy. Oh, got her. Take your stuff. Ooh, nice. Okay, all right. Um, One second, I'm going to be looting every single. Okay, I don't know what our carry weight is. Oh, we're about out of carrying weight, but let's go. Let's go. I'm already having a good time. This is wacky. Is there any better gear I can have right now? Can I identify that? Brilliant Sapphire Staff. Okay, I mean, that's kind of our thing. Except I don't know where it went now. I really don't know where it went. Okay. I'm mean, gonna go with the claymore. I don't know where it went though. It's really just weird. We check. Oh, no, no, I dropped it on the ground apparently. I just grab that. Okay. After we identified, apparently it also drops it. Okay, now I've got a magic staff. That's lovely. Didn't get any better clothes. We've got a couple of range weapons as well. Yeah, we do have a little bit of... Did we get a potion of healing? I think we did have a little something. That's a potion of cure-all. You and recipes. Do I have enough? I need some bruise root. I still need bruise root for that. Okay, never mind then. Uh, I think we do have one potion though. Let's drink that. Okay. I'll do it. I have no idea where we're going. Oh, yeah, this way. Oh, this way. Okay. Sorry, I did get quite a bit of loot. Oh god. Uh, I'll sneak behind. You guys get that. I'm just looking. Why are we running? We're kicking you these guys' butts. No, 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 this way. Oh, there's more coming. Uh, I'm gonna hide. Yeah! Oh, I helped. These guys are severely well armed, though. Uh, Alright, we're gonna just get out of here. Okay, we're... Do we have a thing going? I'm just very curious. We seem to be very close. Now listen to me. Listen closely. This is important. The Lady Espen was the love of my life. My one love. There was nothing arranged about our betrothal. <laughs> can, can, can we talk about your dead wife some other time, sir? We haven't time for your smart remarks. You never saw her yourself. Not that you'd remember. Oh! But if you had, she. I. Okay, I am your daughter. Oh, that makes a lot of sense. Gods damn these Derongold swine. Behind me is my dressing chamber. Go fetch my sword from there. Okay. Dressing chamber, go fetch the sword. At once, my lord. I'll go wherever I'm needed. Little belt as well. I might just take a little bit. Is that your sword? You're gonna lock the doors on me. Oh, okay, yes. He's gonna protect us. 
So that's his son, the ginger. Oh, Jesus. Found you at last, father. Didn't figure you would try and hide from your fate. To be betrayed by my own son. Who wouldn't hide from such a terrible end? I've learned a few things, you see. Things your priests and men-at-arms could never teach. I have gained a new perspective. Seen the truth of this world. So, you were not even paid in coin to turn traitor against your own house. Only pretty words. Kill me if you wish. But I promise it will avail you nothing. Every man pays for his sins, my son. And the price of a sin such as this, well... Enough of your piety! It sickens me. But your last decision, at least, is the correct one. Hold still, father. Oh, daddy, no! Don't worry, my child. Your hardships are over for today. <laughs> okay. That was actually a very good start. I enjoyed it. Honestly, it's a little rough around the edges, but... Um, yeah, this is a proper old school feel. Get up, lazy girl. It's time to go to bed. Um, what? 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 Does this look like Rothgar's realm to you? You're in my hut. Is yes, you just teleported me here, I guess? But no more questions for tonight. There's a cot over there. You should try to get a good night's sleep. Tomorrow will be a very, very long day. Okay. Restaurant place here. Okay, do we actually I'll just need to go on the cot or... Oh, kitty. Can we pet the cat, though? Nope. It's, uh, zero out of ten, literally unplayable. Well, let's go to rest, then. Wake up. Lazy. Always sleeping, this one. Must have been raised by dream wraiths. Oh, that's... I'll, I'll hit it right back. Now, how about you make yourself useful and weed the garden? Uh, I got some questions first. How did I end up here, really? Okay, so I was about to get murdered. That's true. Alright, so you whisked me away. Did you know him? A good man, but a bad father. <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> Who are you? Just an old witch. I don't intend to turn you into... I, would, I wasn't really th thinking you were going to. Take a look at this list. Once you've read it, let me know. Please. Okay, so I got a list. I need bruised root, a brown stem mushroom, and a slab of fox meat. Okay. Also, not sure if I should have grabbed so much stuff. But I mean, we could have, I figured we could sell it at the very least, so. Alright. Feeling well? Oh, good, good. You know how to read. I have something that will help you gather what we need without hurting yourself. Too much. Here, put these on. Okay, so we got a special gardening gloves. Okay. Got special gloves, very nice. Uh, we did get to identify that belt as well. A light elven belt, plus two to aim and accuracy, and plus two dodge chance. Give me 
go right there. Okay, there we go. Okay, so brewing and drying is up a little bit percentage from that. Oh, very nice. Okay. On I guess my way. I will go uh, out in the world and garden. A little bit later loading times to now, so that's a little bit better. I'll do it. Yes. I am not well just now, okay? Uh, so you want me to go kill yellow spiders? Wow, I could murder you. I like the freedom. How'd you gonna be poisoned though? Tell me more about these awful spiders. Okay, so this might be a manifestation of the greed, I guess. I... Sure. North and south... And to the west. I mean, if we see it... Spider colonies this way. Uh, I don't way. know if I'm really... Is it these guys? I'm spy okay, crap. I think that must be a close by Here spell. Go again. Yeah. You little... I'm not gonna die of spiders. Come on, we can do this. Hey, all right. Didn't totally die. No loot, okay. You guys seem to be minding your own business, so I'm not gonna murder you. Oh, those are bigger spiders. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, nope, nope. And the fox as well. We do need fox meat. Of course. Sorry, I gotta murder you, dude. I don't really want to, but... I guess I can order it to... I guess you're probably friendly. I think he's friendly though, so this might have maybe that's one might be the fox, I guess. Come on. Just not okay, so we actually have an attack button, never mind. You've got this coming. No! You're a murderer. Oh gee, okay, that's horrible. Okay, I'm officially a bad person. I'll go wherever I'm needed. Okay, so we got the fox meat. I think that's more spiders. I can't really tell. Yep. All right. Come on. I oh. needed that organ. <laughs> okay, that's kind of cute. I needed that organ. Okay, that would get annoying after a while, though, probably. Okay. So we're poisoned, so we're going to take a little bit of damage, and hopefully not. Oh, goodness. Okay. We got two more turns. We will probably live. We should probably rest a little bit, though. That seems like the place to be. Yeah. I don't, I don't think she wants it right away. I'll do it. Yeah, we gotta heal, because that's 4 to 13. Not great. 
It didn't heal it's On my all way. the way, but we're doing all right. I'll do it. That's another spider colony. Baker's bus, old stump. Probably the old stump. Just keep an eye out for spiders. Bruise root. Ah, that's what I need. Good job. That's a lot of spiders, though. I kind of feel like you should rest a little bit. Yeah, let's hurry back and eh, just rest a little bit more. Otherwise, that's going to be a bit of a bad time. I gotta say though, it's a little bit of a slow I'll burn, it. but it's uh, winning me over. Okay. On my way. I'll do it. There's a little bit of nostalgia, you know. It's. Get some more mushrooms over here. I'm gonna have to murder you guys, aren't I? I mean, maybe we could get along, but probably not. Here we go again. Okay, hit right away. Uh, damn it! Guys, come on! It's the spider. Step on it. Okay, very nice. Run some mushrooms. I do know we needed that. There's an old stump over here. Can we take out that spider colony, that spider colony, and on my way. What exactly did we need for this one, though? Okay, so we actually did get all the ingredients. I guess we could head back. I don't think we're in a hurry to work on the... Those spiders looked actually a little tougher, though. Oh. You've got this coming. <laughs> I'm about to bust the cap. Oh, I love it. All right. Those spiders over there looked slightly more dangerous. The four spiders. Yeah, I'm gonna be stupid and we're gonna try it. Oh, never mind. They're just regular spiders. Not sure what I was worried about. Of course. Let's see what this is as well. And we got a moon glider. All right. So with two classes, we are going to need a lot more XP to level, but I think it makes it very interesting. Very interesting. Uh, did I get wow. all your spiders yet? Yep, I got it. <laughs> like I could rob you and take your stuff. No, no, thank you. Okay, so we helped them out. We weren't a total like that. Seems like I kind of enjoy an RPG. Kind of maybe of tyranny. I have to remember uh, that one. That had varying degrees of kind of in the middle ground of the like. But some of these RPGs are just like you can either be a paragon or completely horrible. There's not always in between, and I do appreciate the in between. That just seems like, oh, hey, I'm gonna murder you right away. I'm like, wow. I'll do it. What do you need? Good. You put your gloves on just like the rest of us. All fingers at the same time. I might murder her, though. You weren't trying to put them on one finger at a time, were you? Maybe.
Oh, you were gonna give me a staff? Yeah, how do you know what's in my pack anyway? Because I've got a lot of gear. Right, the nose knows. Yeah, what's going on though? What? What's this? Did you forget to make these herbs edible, child? Come now, you must try them to bring out the flavor. Surely you've cooked before? Nope. I have to wonder what that Lord Espen even had your tutors teach you at his fancy estate. Oh, <laughs> oh well, take this candle and get to drying. Okay, so we can... All right, so we can do drying now. And then we got a candle, and then we... Okay, very nice. Now that we've dried it. The candle was consumed in the process, but now we can start crushing. Alright, so we got a couple powders. Collect that up. Okay, very nice. This is... Good, good, well and dried. Give me just a moment and... Very interesting. There. It's on the fire. Now we have a few precious moments to spare. We should talk. About talking. You're trying to teach me something. Yeah, maybe. I'm gonna talk about benefit greatly in difficult times ahead. Okay. Let's try to suck up a little bit. Yeah, why did you save me? Okay, so the land's out of balance. Who are you, really? Okay, you tutorial lady. Two questions. Okay, is this too ready, though? No, there's something you should know. When you leave here, the world you knew yesterday will be gone. Wait, uh, how long have I been here? The attack on the Espen estate was only the first oh, okay. spark was like of a consuming years later. fire, I am afraid. Much will be lost to strife and war. There are worse things than war, though. There is something you must understand before you leave here. A great and terrible curse has fallen over Isilmerald and much of the rest of Yerengal. It drives men and women to madness. It starves the prince and turns the pauper to a life of desperation. It is the essence of avarice itself. A curse of greed spreads through the land. Yeah, what do you mean greed? I mean, it's it's kind of just a vice. A terrible covetousness that hides in mortal hearts. It is among the darkest of dreams. But this is no normal greed, no. There is magic behind it. No mere apprentice's catrip either. It is most dangerous, and you must understand that. Ah, the stew is done now. Just let it cool. Yeah, I know. I know a spell or two. Okay, I know. I know one spell. Okay, go out. You give me a scroll. Okay. I can summon a spider. Okay, magic will keep me alive, but it also can be very dangerous.
There's a trap in this room. Oh no, this is turning into saw. Oh, I see it. Yeah. On my way. Okay, use our skills. I'm a bit of a scufflaw, aren't you? I've been... Please, madam, I never scoff. I mostly chuckle. See the cat? But he sees me. Okay, so, yeah, so we do have a couple different things they're teaching us since we do have a multi-class. Of course. Infusion of berry juice, I'm gonna take you as well. I did forget where I was supposed to go, though. Cabinet to her bed with that being seen. Okay, that's uh. Do, 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 do. Let's just let the cat go through a patrol. What? That cat did not see me. That cat is a liar. I gotta go behind this cabinet. Hmm. I'll go wherever I'm needed. Let's go. Aha, gotcha! Yeah, because I just ran right past him. It should have... Right. Okay, now we go pick a lock. It was cooked, all right. I see that look in your eye again. No, no more questions for today. Eat your stew and get some rest. Well, I'm also gonna take your stuff. We're probably a little over now, but... Hey, all right. Not bad, though. Oh, so I'm gonna have a little slow. Can I stuff some stuff in here, though? Just because, uh, until we can get somewhere to sell this stuff. I don't think they ever thought anybody was just gonna start looting everything on the battlefield when they first came in. Alright, I'm gonna leave you here. I don't know if we'll be able that to come back like here or not, but... This one... Very interesting, I do have to say. Yeah, we're about an hour in, so we'll just give about the first hour or so. Uh, it's not the highest caliber CRPG, but this is, it's got some personality. I do enjoy it thus far. There were a couple loading screens in the beginning that seemed a little longer than they should be for what they were, but now it seems like that's lessening at least a little bit on this part. Graphically, yeah, it is kind of the old school charm as well. Voice acting is kind of hit or miss, uh, but do appreciate the voice acting not on everything, but overall... If you like PC and you enjoy an old school uh, CRPG, keep it on your list. Maybe just wait for a sale as well. 30 bucks is kind of a high price for this one, I think, but it's got some personality. Uh, so I do think I, I do like it quite a bit. But I really don't. If you guys enjoyed, be sure to hit that like button. It does help out a lot. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.